Why is this so heavy? Oh my gosh. Hey guys, so it's finally the end of the semester and oh my gosh, this semester put me through it. Like literally, this was such a hard semester. It's literally the hardest I've ever gone through and I just need to like take my mind off of things, lean out my backpack and let all these emotions out. I need them out of my bag, out of my life because it's time to move on, you know? As you can see, I'm a student at Yale University. I know, I'm smart, and Yale is not easy. It was such a hard sem- <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm not a student at Yale. I just wore this shirt because I want people looking at the thumbnail to think I'm smart and click on the video, so yeah. Sorry if I tricked you. I just wore this for fun, and um, yeah. But no, actually, this semester was so freaking hard. Like, I can't even believe that I made through it. Like, I don't want to complain too much, but I'm here to clean out my backpack, which here's my beautiful backpack. You know, I actually finished school like last week, but you know how when you like turn in your last final, you just need to relax. I turned in that last final and I literally just went to sleep and watched YouTube. That's all I did for the last week. <laughs> This thing is so heavy, like, I literally cannot believe I used to wear this and walk for like half an hour at some points on campus. Let's just start unboxing my bag and cleaning it out. Okay, so I literally haven't touched this thing in probably the last two months, because everything's been an online school, so I just use my computer and my iPad, and all this other stuff has just been laying on my floor. Speaking of that, the first item is my laptop. I have this nice, silver, nice, pretty, nice, um, cool, nice laptop but yeah this is what it looks like that's what that side looks like this isn't something i'm gonna throw away we're cleaning out my backpack but i'm keeping this one obviously and then the next thing we have is my ipad this is where i do all of my work on my homework my notes every time i get a chance to plug this i'm going to so if you want to see a video about how the ipad can help you in school and how it makes you organize click that card up there or if it's up there i don't remember but yeah basically these two devices have really just just like, what's the word? Man, I forgot how to speak English. They helped me. There is a better word for that, I don't know. Facilitate. Wait, I should put this up here so you guys can see. Oh, I didn't even talk about my backpack. Look, this is my backpack. It's this beautiful, like, dark gray type of backpack. It's by Herschel. This is not sponsored, but I've had Herschel backpacks for the last, like, seven years. Seven years. And this is going to be my eighth because I'm going to be senior. Basically, all of high school and college, I've had Herschel bags because they're literally the best thing in the world. Even though this bag is beautiful, it used to be more beautiful because... Is beautiful our word? Be beautifuler. No, that's not a word, is it? Man, I don't care. This used to have this little Patrick Star pin on it. Oh my gosh, it was the best thing in the world. But I dropped it. Well, I didn't drop it. I was just like on this bus and I guess it just fell off. <laughs> and it was literally, it was literally like the hardest time I've ever gone through. Okay, but yeah, let's not get distracted and keep on cleaning out my bag. So the next thing I have is this. Even though I have my iPad to like take my notes and everything, there are always those professors that literally make you turn in stuff in class. I still have to have a notebook where I like fill stuff out. And I've had this notebook for two years. I like haven't even finished it. But as you can see, this thing is so freaking thick. Let's see what we have in here. We have some lab reports, homeworks, peer evaluations. Oh, this is just giving me PTSD at this point. See, like, look at this. What even is that? Like, mm, okay, but I guess we have to like clean this stuff out. I'm just gonna like take out. Oh, I kind of ripped it. Homework, homework. What is that? Man, I don't even know what that is. Oh, that's not cute. That's. A really bad grade. Homework, homework, homework. Okay, this is all homework. Okay, bye. What do we have in here? Oh, y'all are gonna think I'm super cool and really awesome when I say this. So beware before you think I'm like the coolest person in the world. I was a treasurer for a club. Can you believe that? Me holding a leadership position. If any of my like hiring managers or anyone is watching this right now, 
I held a leadership position and I was the best treasure this club has ever seen. I think I should keep these for safekeeping just in case they like ask for proof of anything. Um, is there anything else in here? I mean, the rest of it is just like paper. So I guess we're done with this stuff. Wait, actually I don't wanna throw that away. I think I'm putting like the stuff I wanna throw away on this side and then the stuff I'm keeping on this side. So I'm still gonna keep this because there's a lot of paper in here from my last year. So what do we have next? We have this planner. I keep myself so organized with this thing. I don't understand. Some people literally go to class and then they just like do all their work. Like, I don't understand how you do that. How do you remember when your stuff is due? I need a planner to like write everything down just like this. See, we have all these things and you know, I just like cross them out as I go. That also gives me satisfaction. Like whenever I have like, for example, this, I have like seven things due in one day and I get to cross them off as I go. It makes me feel so much better. Like, oh yes, I only I have two more things to do, only one more thing to do. Speaking of which, did I cross out the last thing? No, oh my gosh, I forgot to cross out that my final exams are finished. See, I was just so done with the semester, I submitted that exam and I went to sleep. Let's cross that out and we're free, Woo! <laughs> Actually, I still need this for summer. I'm taking summer classes. <laughs> I only have a few weeks of break and then I have to take summer classes. So I'm still gonna need this to plan that stuff out. So I can't throw that away. So let's put that over there. Next, we're pretty much done with this compartment except for some stray papers. Let's see what these are. Oh, okay. I mean, here we have just like this paper. You have a pad. What else do we have here? Handwriting check. Da, 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 da. Oh, here's a good thing that I always say when I'm in class. This makes no sense. Oh, okay. So this is just an art piece showing the social constructs of society and how college students function in a world where we have way too much information and that we cannot handle that capacity. What am I even saying? That doesn't even sound good. Like I'm trying to be some kind of art critic or something. No. What about these other papers? We have a great Bay home. If you heart us, leave us a review. And if you don't let us know, we'll work on a customer service at greatbayhome.com. You know, I don't know what this is. Go leave them an email that Patrick sent you. Actually don't do that. Here we have have art to pen, blah, blah, blah. <gasps> oh, an exam. Wait, what did I get on this exam? Boys, I got a hundred. 100 out of 100. Wow. Yeah, I'm keeping this for safekeeping. I might frame this later, so we're keeping that one. Now let's move on up here. There's like this pocket up here on this back and it's supposed to be a sunglass holder, but why would I wear sunglasses to glass? So I use it on my pencil holder. I mean, I do still have glasses in here. I have these. Wow, these make me look so cool. But yeah, I wear these to lab because you have to wear glasses, like goggle type glasses to lab so that you don't get like chemicals or like chips of metal in your eyes. And then basically the rest of the stuff in here, I think is just like writing things. So we have like markers and we have pens and pencils. By the way, I need to speak on these pencils for a second. These pencils changed my life. They're so good. They write so smooth. The ergonomics of this is phenomenal. Like I feel like I would never be where I am today if it weren't for these pencils. So now we have these front two. We have this one and this one. The first thing we have is my calculator. Man, when did I get this calculator? I think I got it when I was joining high school. So like seven years ago, these calculators so good. Like I feel like this stuff has so much potential. Like there's so much stuff you can do with this thing. But I'm literally out here doing like two plus two equals four because you know, you always got to check you're on the exam. You got to make sure two plus two still equals four. So the next in here we have this. Now this is my portable rain jacket. Mmm, isn't that smart? It's like this rain jacket you like fold up and you can just keep it on your bag in case you're like in class and it randomly starts raining, you have a jacket. So yeah, this is my rain jacket. <laughs> Why do I look like that? As you can see, there are a lot of wrinkles because this just stays folded in my bag the whole time. So the next thing we have in here is another calculator. Now, some teachers are so picky, like they think these calculators will let you cheat. So you need a four function calculator. Here's me with my plus minus divide and equals. Did I miss one? 
plus minus divide and multiplication. That's the fourth one. So sometimes I have to use these little suckers instead of that big beefy daddy over there. Okay, and then we have, oh my gosh, I literally haven't held this thing in three years. This, for those of y'all who don't know, is an eye clicker. It's like a little like surveying thing. You see it says like A, B, C, D, E. Basically the teacher like puts a question on the board and then you have to say your answer, A, B, C, D, or E. I spent like $50 on this thing and I literally only use it for one class. I just think that's disgusting. This thing has been just like carrying weight in my backpack ever since because I just never know if my teacher's ever gonna want me to use it. And then the last thing in this compartment is this. Wow, look at me. I look so good in that picture. It's this badge I have for like, there's like this thing on campus for all the engineers where you like have all like the machines. You have like the lathe machines where you can like the metal stuff. And then you have the mill machine where you do the other metal stuff. And then there's also like saws where you can do more metal stuff. Basically this thing is like you go in. I did not explain that well. This thing is like where you like scan it and then you like clip it like this so that you know they know that you're authorized and then you like go in and then you like do and like I just need to stop talking at this point. I swear this semester like did something to my brain. Like literally they put a blender inside of my head. But yeah, this I'm I'm not even gonna try and explain it. This is just like a pass. If I try and explain it more, I'll probably have a seizure or something. Okay, and we're finally down to our last compartment. So in here we have charging cable for all your cell phone charging needs. And then here we have, what is this? This is a receipt from the grocery store. What did I buy? One H-E-B cream cheese brick. Is that it? Just one cream cheese brick, that's all I bought. Anyways, I think that's about it. Let me just check all these little spots, make sure I didn't miss anything. But I think that's it for my backpack cleaning. I don't know what kind of cleaning this was. I literally just spread everything all around the place. <laughs> I don't want to start school again. Okay, well, thanks for watching. I hope some of y'all like sat down, and, like cleaned your backpack out with me. If you didn't, then just rewind, watch this video again, and then clean your backpack out with me. If you're new, you should consider subscribing because that's a nice thing to do. And I guess that's it. So I'll see you next. Someone's calling me. That's kind of scary. Okay, see you next week. Peace. I'm going to go answer the phone.